What is up, Earl's fam? You guys, I've been working so hard today cleaning the house. Ranger, off. Off, buddy. Off. Like I was saying, I've been cleaning the house, just going like super ham. Been up since like seven. Are you kidding me, buddy? Okay, you know what? Just roll the intro and we'll go somewhere else. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand. To the fire, but it's no use because you can't stop okay so like i was saying i've been cleaning all day harold's mom and grandma are coming over they're going to be here in about 10 minutes Whew, i'm still in my pajamas which are actually harold's pajamas because i mean who doesn't wear their loved one's pajamas when they're gone like clothes whatever i mean you know that's just what i do i live in my husband's clothes so i'm already exhausted but i'm really proud of myself i'm going to show you guys like I got the whole floor of our bedroom like picked up and I don't know if you guys actually saw it messy but like I mean you couldn't even see the carpet because clothes were just everywhere. I got that done. I got my closet done. I picked up the kitchen even though there's still some junk right here I gotta do. Whew, I did so much laundry. Y'all I'm pretty dang proud of myself. I don't know where my energy came from but thank the lord I'm glad it did. Still got some messy things here, but that's okay. Anyways, I'm super excited for his mom and grandma to be here. Just to, you know, have a distraction, spend some time together because it sucks. He's gone and I miss him already. And last night was the first night without him and it's just not fun. <laughs> it is just not fun. And I haven't heard from him either. I was hoping that he was gonna be able to call cause he could bring his cell phone, but nothing yet. So I, I think this whole time, I'm probably not gonna get to hear from him, which totally sucks but just means I have to be extra strong. But anyways, that's my update for now. We'll catch up in a little bit. So yesterday after the like one clip that I did, of course Harold's mom and grandma came over and then I just completely passed out after talking to them because I was so exhausted from cleaning all day. That's what happens when you're pregnant and you get a burst of energy and you use the energy and then you just sleep, so. Didn't get to show you what I wanted to show you, but now I can do that. Also, I didn't know if I was gonna put this vlog up today or do it tomorrow because I started to really miss Harold. Hi honey, I miss you. Um, but you know what? I just need to do something and distract myself. That is one of the best things that you can do when your loved one is away and you're missing them. So I'm gonna show you guys what has been happening. Puppies are coming with me. I'm going up the stairs. I'm gonna show you what the bedroom looks like now. Honey, you're gonna be so impressed. Quickly before I actually show you, let me explain something. So um, when Harold's mom and grandma were here, they were gonna help me look for um, blinds because we don't have any and it's been not good having just nothing over our windows. So we went and looked at blinds and like, holy moly, they're expensive and we just weren't expecting it to be that expensive. Um, so then we looked at curtains and like, it just all is so expensive. So I was like, you know what? I should probably wait until Harold's home and then we will decide all this together. I'm also out of breath. <laughs> wow, all I did was walk up the stairs. So what we decided to do was to hang up sheets over the windows. So it was just like whatever leftover ones I had. I have two blue ones that are downstairs. But of course in our bedroom, you know, Gotta do something a little different. All I had was a camo fitted sheet, which looks ridiculous, and then a Christmas tablecloth. So that's what's hanging up over my windows right now. So forgive that, but let me just, you know, just, I don't know. Okay, so I, I clearly still have to clean this up, but that's not part of the room, so ignoring that. Look at this clean floor! Look at it! Oh, I'm talking to my dogs, but I'm actually talking to you guys. Okay, so we got some dirty laundry over here. Still have to do that. We got this thing cleaned off. It's not like, you know, pretty like how it's gonna be, but you know, it's clean, you know? We got some clean clothes I have to put away, some pillows I gotta put pillowcases on. You know, the windows. We got my little, um, whatchamacallit thing where I do my makeup and whatnot. We got our bed literally clean, 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 clean. We got the drawers over here. Also again, not pretty. Nothing in here is pretty yet. Um, I don't know if this stuff will stay there, but whatever, I just, whatever. Just my normal computer stuff that I use every day. I still have to clean this up, but you know what? That is impressive right there. Like, ha at me. Can you give me a high five? No, okay, really, whatever. I don't think I actually really showed when everything was super messy, but if you follow me on Snapchat, 
um, or just in like some of the shots you could see like yo there is junk all over the floor I know in the vlog where I'm washing the puppies you could definitely tell like the bathroom was just like trash like there was just stuff everywhere so I'm pretty proud of this too I mean look at this clean floor over here what it's clean okay so don't mind the two jackets I get cold so you know um, my chair because I get lazy and have to sit down while I do my hair um, I just bought this stuff today because Harold stole our toothpaste. So I had to go get some toothpaste of my own. Um, but we have a clean countertop. I still have to figure out, this is something you guys can help me with. We need to get some type of fixture over here for like towels or something. I don't know, but help a sister out. We got Harold's side over here. You know, nothing really happening over here. But honey, your razor is down here in case you're wondering. Okay, okay. Uh, we haven't hung any pictures up or anything. Got this little thing, just some bath stuff in it over here. Bath was already clean. Shower, and this, my closet, holy cow. Okay, it looks like it's like red in here, but this also was completely trashed. Like shoes everywhere, like clothes, every, it was just, it was a hot mess. So again, it's not completely organized. Like I don't even know if I'll keep it like this. And the clothes are certainly not organized, but um, at least, you know, stuff is in a place as of right now and it's not on the floor. So we can actually use it and that is really wonderful. I know that doesn't seem like a lot, but y'all, that in itself took me like from 7 a.m. to like 5 p.m. So it was just a lot of stuff because Harold, when we moved in and we were um, just opening all our boxes to get rid of the boxes, so he dumped all of our clothes just all over the floor like everything so it was just like a lot of stuff to pick up anyways now i'll show you what the sheets are like downstairs it just looks super ratchet but like at least i have some more privacy now so we have a nice big blue curtain over here also honey your uh mom and grandma brought all of your bats uh we also have more guns which are upstairs i think they brought like four more guns holy cow and not this box there's more stuff of yours i don't know where it is you got more crap so i don't know what we're gonna do with it and then of course honey your mom and grandma had to bring over a present for the baby um which by the way our baby is no longer baby russell sprout but baby apricot because today we hit 12 weeks which is crazy um but anyways this super cute soft blanket which is like honestly the softest thing ever like i might have to snatch the sucker for myself and then this is so cute okay first we have this little book right here it says colors there's just like little tabs and like shows the color and stuff and i just totally see our baby like playing with this and like me reading and or maybe you're reading it i don't know and just like totally being a teacher and like i don't know i'm super excited and this is my favorite thing ever so it says my very first prayers and it has a handle too so like little one can like hold it around and bring her little or him or her whoever you are little prayer book with them and i'm just like that's the cutest thing ever so we'll be saying prayers with our little baby with this sucker so i'm really excited i think this is like the cutest thing ever like this is um thank god that you love him and thank him for making you thank him for your home your food and parents that love you too like ah oh, so cute our baby isn't even close to being born but is already like totally spoiled and everyone has already given us so many gifts so i need to think of a spot to like keep all the baby stuff right now so that's what i was doing earlier i was like oh wait i gotta pull out this onesie and this little dress i bought it a while ago and like put all the baby stuff together so it's not like all over the place you know what i'm saying but here we go, back in the family room, another big blue sheet. There she is. I also cleaned up the kitchen and did like 15 loads of laundry, no joke, yesterday. Wait, no, was it yesterday? Yeah, yesterday. Like, I was a freaking powerhouse, honey. Like, I don't know where my energy came from, but like, I was crushing it, except I still have another load to do. But it's still actually a little bit messy over here, so I still have to clean up a little bit, but I'm making some progress now. There's still so much to be done. Like my other goal is to like really work on the office before you get home, honey, because it's a hot mess in there. I mean, it's a hot mess like in the other two rooms as well, but like the office, we need to work on the office. Okay, I think I have collected all of the baby stuff. I figured I'd go through it really quick and then put it in this drawer right now because that's one of our only empty drawers. So let's do this. 
so first we got our two elephants um, which are super super cute and this is actually really good the dogs are really interested and want the elephants because we can keep one like in the crib and one in like the little like pack and play whatever that like stays downstairs because you know it's probably gonna get attached and like always want it to be with him or her so it's probably good that we have two okay so next we have this little dress that I bought um, when I was in Guatemala, so this is only gonna work if we have a girl, but you know Bought a dress because I thought it was so cute Okay, I love this one so much or this is two, but hold on. I got a text Okay, major bummer. It wasn't Harold. It was Krista. Hey Krista. Love you girl uh, But you know, you're not Harold. <laughs> okay. Anyways, so um this super cute onesie that has all these like bumblebees all over it and then there's the white one underneath it that says Burt's Bees baby super cute wait how do you actually fold baby clothes like what's the actual I don't know there's so many things mommy has to learn so many things next we have this super cute outfit with a little hat and the little cute top and pajamas like, should I keep this on the hanger? I feel like maybe I should keep the hanger. So I'll just put it in here for now. I don't know. And you guys, I know some of you guys have asked if um, we have started anything on the nursery. Oh no, let me, I'll show you in a second what the nursery looks right now. Looks like right now, but like, we got a long ways to go. Okay, next we have this, which is from my mom, I guess, and my dad, um, which was the first. Thing, I think maybe I don't know um, but super super cute this all stuff is just everyone got like super cute stuff I mean of course they did and everything is already covered in dog hair that's a problem oh <laughs> this is for me this is for the baby motherhood needs grace and coffee from Chels I'm gonna put that up there because I need to start wearing that here we have the little towel set I think this is the cutest thing ever Oh, with all the elephants. Man, I cannot wait. I haven't even bought anything. Well, I guess I bought the Guatemalan dress, but like I haven't gotten anything myself. I can't wait. And these I think are little like towels, right? So cute to go with that. And then we have a little elephant little ring thing. So, man, we got like a full drawer, guy. Oh wait, that's not even all of it. Crud, I gotta reorganize. I was about to say we had a full drawer, but we gotta make some more room. So we gotta add the stuff from grandma and great grandma. Ooh. So we gotta add the blanket in there. This is just a spoiled little baby. You guys think you're spoiled, but little baby is spoiled. And add our two books. Yes. Range, do you wanna learn how to read? To teach ya. And then, I almost forgot too, the little cross that we have that says Child of God. There we go, that completes our drawer for right now. I mean, that's a pretty good stock for only 12 weeks long. Woohoo! I want you to take a moment, I want you to picture what you think the nursery looks like right now, okay? Just hold on to that. You're like, maybe picture it being like super cute and like all put together before I show you the heart, like, horror of what it actually looks like right now. It's really scary. All right. And right as you walk in the door, we have a big pile of Harold's Army stuff. Just, you can't even walk in the room. We've got boxes on boxes on boxes on boxes on more boxes on more boxes back there. We've got paintings. We've got suitcases. We've got backpacks. We've got trees. We've got trash. I don't know. We've got it all. Also, these are the guns I was talking about, honey. We got three more guns and a sword. Your grandma tells me as she's unloading the guns out of the car, she's like, well, I'm not sure if these are loaded, but I was like, are you serious? I was like, well, that is just dangerous. And she's like, well, how do you look? I was like, oh my sweet heavens. I was like, I can let me take that from you, please. So, um, yeah, we're locked and loaded. And the puppies were loving having your mom and grandma here. Like, Ranger was obsessed with your mom. Like, I kept telling her, I think he thinks that you're Harold. Like, I think he thinks that you, like, he's in disguise or something. You guys must smell the same or like, I don't know, something about the DNA that like, he could detect or something, but 
he was all over your mom just like licking her face and like wanting to cuddle and just like so attached to her and i think it's because obviously you weren't here i don't think it would be like that if you were here but it was like like are you my dad like i know you're my dad like you're my dad i can smell you um so that was a good laugh and then Ganga was just scratching tracker and she's falling over it was really cute um so they definitely loved the company okay one last story for you honey and then i'll wrap this vlog up but this morning i was taking a shower i'm you know in the shower enjoying it like having a good old time and my phone rings which was like on the counter over here right and i bolted just like open the door slam it like water still running completely butt naked like drenched in water i just like got water all over the floor thinking that you were calling me but you weren't i don't even know who it was because i didn't have the number saved in my phone but it was really sucky so i don't know what the deal is i don't know why like i guess you don't have service i don't know but i freaking miss you <laughs> and i miss your voice and it's not fun but you know at least i got the puppies and having your mom and grandma over was a good distraction now i just gotta tough it out i don't know if my mom is coming she kind of like talked about it but we'll see um so i love you and i miss you and i'm ready for you to freaking get back here already so be safe out there and uh hopefully i'll have a little bit more of the house done hopefully the office will be like kind of put together i don't know what else but like I'm gonna try. I, I want you to be impressed when you come home. Even though I know you're not gonna be impressed like with the um, curtains slash whatever you call those blinds because I mean, whatever. You're gonna laugh at me, but still. I want you to be impressed and be like, are you kidding me? Like, I can't believe you did all this. So, we'll see. And you guys, um, I could totally use some, hey! Okay, okay, it's not play time. You guys, I could totally use some suggestions. So in all of our bathrooms, Actually, we don't have any type of fixtures um, for hand towels or um, in the toilets, too. We don't have any fixtures for um, toilet paper. Like, I don't know why. We just don't have any of those things. So, if you guys want to leave me some suggestions, then that would be really awesome. Actually, honey, I had one other thing I wanted to tell you before I forget. Of course, I could text you all this, but, like, let's be real. I know you're not going to read it, and then I'll probably forget. So, this is probably the best way. So, we went out to eat at, I was going to say Chipotle, but it's not Chipotle. Chili's. Um, and when we were there, I ordered, like, the uh, margarita Mexican bowl or something like that. I have, it's not really appealing as the leftovers, a little bit of the leftovers, but it's kind of like a chipotle bowl. Since they don't have chipotle here, I, it's got the rice, the beans, it's got lettuce, it's got chicken, it's got corn, it's got salsa. I asked for sour cream and it was filling. I couldn't even eat all of it, so we can totally share it. And it's only $10, so I was like, wow, this could like fix our chipotle cravings. So when you come back, we gotta go there. Time for me to end the vlog, so love God. Love people, make a difference, and be thankful. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I know um, it's totally different than normal, um, but just showing you some of the stuff that I've been doing, like cleaning and organizing, stuff like that. Do you miss Daddy? Do you miss him? Ow, kid, that's my face. Do you miss Daddy too? Do you miss Daddy? You do? You miss Daddy? Oh, okay. So there's not gonna be a vlog tomorrow because I filmed this today, but there will probably be one the following day. So I hope that's okay with you guys. Um, leave me some requests below, um, what you wanna see me vlog while he's gone and what you want me to do on my second channel. And <clears throat> some bump dates and you know, stuff like that that I know you guys wanna see. So I think that is my plan for while Harold is away to just like pump out some videos on my second channel you know go give that channel some love like it needs some help um so i think i'm gonna do stuff like that but anyways like i said um i love you guys and i hope you guys have a good rest of your weekend and i will see you in two days all right love you guys bye